everyone in this video I'm going to tell you how to make cyanide and FS character in flash CS6 this is section script 3.1 so take the oval tool for paste or press O take stroke as 5 this is color perfect this is skin color ok oval paste for the eyes take skin color as black and stroke color to get none no stroke color no stroke line ok and press shift so that it can be circle eyes if you don't press shift it will make an oval so by pressing shift take the selection tool pressing P Press Alt to, to duplicate those. Make it here. Okay. Reduce the size. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Take the pen uh, line tool N. Let's make a line N. Take the opacity black. should be 5 style should be hard line okay. no sorry take this and drag it so uh, is the face of it so we have to group all it is and group by pressing ctrl D or you can take it and put it from here that's what the group is and pressing Ctrl G. Take the bucket tool and the eye dropper tool by pressing I or the hold can be found here. Take this color and fill it in. Selection tool and then group everything on the face, but not this. Group. Okay, so now we have grouped everything. It's because of range sent it back. Okay. So now we select it here and we have to select it. So here is a face. Now there is 45. Take the rectangle tool. Selection tool. I'm just gonna make it here. Here it is. Here. Okay. Select it and group this tool. Send it to back. And now for hands and and let's take the line tool. Ooh. Just take the line tool. Stroke to seven. Because his hand should be big. I mean, like. Okay, let's see. Group this tool. Control G. Group everything. Send this to back by pressing shift and select everything. Send to back. Okay, that's it. And here the sign of an admit character is ready. You can obviously make some changes by pressing zoom. Is it selection tool and double clicking it? And 
don't know. Maybe we can change make some changes, make some style or whatever. Yeah, I, I don't know. Just now we will make it to a graphic clip. Convert to symbol. Graphic. Sign out and nothing else. So here it is. First of all, we should reduce its size by pressing this transform tool Q. By pressing Shift, so that its size retains its. Should have seen this. Okay. So we can make changes inside it by selecting other keyframes and making it speak or anything any animation i'll make a video for that too thanks for watching the video